Thank you, Joe. How about a warm welcome to our best man, Joe Reeling. I've gotten completely unprepared for this. Uh, if everyone could just turn down their cell phones for a second. The photography of this side actually is, uh, gets me better. Um, thought we could actually use this time to uh, tell you a little bit more about myself and maybe tackle some of the problems I've been facing lately. Uh, honestly, um, first thing I'd love to say is just uh, what a wonderful weekend. You know, last night, I'd like to thank my parents for putting on a wonderful rehearsal dinner. It's beautiful. Uh, yes. Yeah, thank you. And uh, you know, today, uh, Mr. and Mrs. Galvin, just what a wonderful wedding that you guys have put on. And this reception is just the spectacular. And it really is. And, may I just say that the open bar is sensational as well. So, <laughs> Honestly, uh, when Ben first asked me to be the best man, I was, and he was getting married, I was, I was honored and, you know, so excited for them, and, you know, I'm sad that it, I quickly thought of a Las Vegas bachelor party in the uh, but, um, incidentally, due to events that happened that weekend, your gift has been lost in the mail. <laughs> Um, in, in all honesty, all kidding aside, I've, uh, in thinking about what I want to say on Ben's behalf, sorry if I'm a little long-winded, um, it brought back some of the best memories for me, you know, some of the fondest times of my life. And to see you here right now, you know, I see this guy well dressed. Thank you, Lindsay, by the way, for that. And um, you know, this long hair. It just—I can't help but think, gosh, that wasn't always the way it used to be. You know, I remember this kid with the neon yellow sweatpants and the teenage Blue Ninja Turtles T-shirt, and, and of course, my favorite, the crew cut with the spike in the front. Um, and I remember specifically one of my fond memories of saying, hey Ben, you know, I really think you should grow your hair up. It kind of looks silly with a spike. And he said to me, Joe, I will never grow my hair. <laughs> and I, you know, things certainly change. And, and I also, I see, him, I see him here today as this peaceful and serene and spiritual kid. And, and I can remember, and George, you could attest to this, when we were kids, Certain someone ripping basketball rims off the wall and throwing ping pong battles at my head. And uh, I think our parents broke a record for saying, separate yourselves, you can never play again. So, and, and, and even today, you know, I, uh, I borrowed his iPod, he's got a thousand songs. He probably doesn't remember that he was, we co-founded the greatest singles cassette collection ever with uh, hits like War and Cheese, Regulate, and... Uh, <laughs> The sweet sounds of boys to men, end of the road. Uh, but growing up, I, I, again, I just say, I'm, I'm, he's such a well-rounded person. If I could just say a couple of things. I mean, he's such a great athlete, you know, quarterback, and, and then going out with Curtis and Sean and all the great things they did at Milton and Wake Forest. And we all know speed was never his uh, strength, in fact. <laughs> I think you hold the lowest speed rating in, in Sony PlayStation 2005. So, uh, you know, and he's extremely smart. And I soaked up all the B's and C's growing up, I think. And uh, he is my business partner, and uh, we're in business together. And I'll ask him something, and five minutes later, I'm regretting it immediately because he's into a long, complex answer. And I'm thinking, you had me at hello, Ben. <laughs> Um, you know, and, and such a spiritual, caring kid, too. I think Lindsay and him are going to adopt me any day now. And, and Bronx and I will compete for food. That will never be a lose, that battle. So, you know, and, and in all honesty, and, and I know I've been joking around a lot, but Ben is, is simply the most thoughtful, sincere, genuine person that I know. He's a great role model, role model for me. Uh, He's my business partner, he's my best friend, but I hope he knows he's always my baby brother and I'm, I'm gonna take care of him. So, um, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. <laughs> and I would also like to say that it's not a surprise that he's able to attract such, you know, a beautiful and, and, and wonderful and caring person like Lindsay. Uh, and, uh, can, I, can I stop now, is that my, uh, you know, I'm constantly reminded they love too when I log into our business accounts and our password is Lindsay. Every. Uh, <laughs> yeah, good job, Lindsay. 
got, Ben. That's unbreakable. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but, you know, again, uh, I just get back to a little advice that I have for them. And I don't know anything about marriage. Some of you may cracks about that tonight, but um, we'll just skip that portion of it. Um, but here's a couple of things that I've learned, and maybe you can, from my friends who've gotten married, and first is that, you know, children seem to be expensive, and that's something that, you, you know, you might want to consider. Uh, yeah, exactly. Well, my parents keep telling me that, so I don't know. Maybe that's just that. You know, and, and, and also, Ben, when she's not happy, you know, you're not happy. <laughs> and most likely, when she's not happy, you're the call on supplies. <laughs> so, just keep that in mind. But, uh, you know, going to bed early doesn't always mean what it used to be either. I think uh, now it's we gotta get up and hit the Trader Joe's specials at 6 o'clock in the morning. But, um, you're not always going to have the greatest days. You're not always going to look at each other and be wildly in love every moment of your life. But um, my wish for you is that you're able to soak in the moment, like right here, right now, surrounded by all your loved ones um, that have traveled here. You may never have an opportunity like this again. So I just ask that you really soak it in, and you really enjoy it, and you're able to do that for the rest of your lives. Enjoy the moment, and I'd like to make a toast to right here, right now, this moment, and also to a wonderful life. So thank you guys, I appreciate it.